and I am the Family Engagement Liaison at Sneed Elementary. So I hope y'all are all doing uh, well and are safe at home. Uh, I know I don't just speak for myself when I say that we miss y'all dearly. Um, but for now, um, I am going to welcome you into my home. Today I'll be doing a baby parade. So I'm going to be using a couple things. Um, first off, I'm using the baby bullet. But you can use uh, any blender that you have at home. Uh, this is just something that I um, purchased because I wanted to try it out. Um, and then I have a cup of peas here, fully cooked. Um, you can use uh, frozen or fresh. Uh, just make sure that they're fully cooked and that they are um, not hot when you're gonna do the puree. And then for this blend, I have one fourth cup water. And then um, an easier food that you don't have to cook or anything um, is an avocado, a full avocado, peeled and uh, pitted. And then I have one fourth cup water for this blend as well. And um, I have a couple containers here that came with a baby bullet. Uh, so these are ready to use. And the cool thing is that it also comes with a little container that you can actually freeze. Um, so just keep in mind that when making these parades, uh, fresh um, usually stays about uh, three to four days refrigerated. And then you can actually freeze uh, the parades for up to 30 days and it'll be fresh. Just make sure that you thaw it and take it out at least a day or two before actually putting it into use. Um, so let's get started. Um, we are going to start with the peas. Um, so um, this is definitely not as um, convenient as being able to just go into your local store and pick up a jar of baby food, but it's definitely a lot healthier and uh, I believe less expensive. So the green peas have a lot of vitamin uh, K and B6. Uh, it also has a lot of iron and vitamin C, which is really good for the baby's immune system. So right now with everything going on with this uh, coronavirus, uh, we really need to build up those uh, that immune system. So this is great. For um for that enrichment. So I'm just gonna go ahead and um, mix this a little bit. And remember, guys, um, if you um, this is a recipe for four to six months. So my baby girl is uh, officially a supported sitter. All right, guys, so uh, this is, you know, I blended it for 10 seconds and then I check consistency and I add water according to, or if you want to add more vegetable, like I said, if you want it to be a little bit thicker, you're gonna obviously add more vegetable than the water. And so uh, for the green peas, I'm actually going to be freezing them um, for Abigail. So um, this is basically the consistency that you see here. I like it. Uh, it has, you know, a little bit of texture, but it's more watery. Um, she's only been on parades for about three weeks, so I am uh, trying to dilute it uh, the most that I can. And so these will go in here. Um, so the one cup of peas and the one fourth cup of water usually make about eight ounces of her food. Um, she's now eating about two ounces a day. So this will last her uh, for a couple of days. So that's why I'm freezing it um, because I'll be giving her the avocado one first. Okay, so now we're gonna do our avocados. Remember, you don't need to cook these. Uh, these are just gonna be peeled and pitted. Uh, so it's one whole avocado and um, so the really cool thing is that avocados are obviously super healthy. They have lots of uh, vitamins and minerals um, and healthy fats that are essential for baby brain development. Um, so that's really exciting. Um, and I will be putting the one fourth water. And we'll be blending it for 10 seconds. If it's getting a little dry, you can go in there and just kind of move it around. Um, make sure the texture is um, as smooth as you want it. Um, this whole avocado and one fourth cup water usually uh, has about four grams of protein. Um, so super healthy. Abigail to experience with different textures 
And so this one I did uh, leave a little bit thicker. Um, I might just add a little bit more water once I'm ready to be. So this is the final product. I have four um, two ounce servings for Abigail of avocado, fresh avocado uh, puree. And then I also have the frozen ones. I have five two ounce servings. Um, I did. I was able to get a little bit um, an extra serving of the green peas only because I did add an extra one fourth cup of water just so that the consistency uh, could be a lot thinner um, because I do want to mess around with the textures that she'll be getting. Um, but um, if you have any questions or concerns, you can follow me on Twitter at uh, Sneed underscore fame. Uh, thank y'all so much for joining me today. I hope that this was easy to follow. Um, I know that your baby's going to enjoy it because I know that mine does. Uh, so thank you so much. I love you and miss you guys.